The mechanic business has been wild. Case has hired us to work on their tractors. We have one of our trucks hooked up to the Case Harvester, trying to figure out what's wrong with that one. We have our work truck hooked up to this Case tractor, trying to figure out what's wrong with this one. And now we're getting a phone call. Hello? Hi, H Mechanics. My, my, my truck broke down at North Pond. Okay, so your trucks broke down there at the pond on the north side of town? Yeah, it just won't, it won't drive nowhere. Okay, we'll, we'll be right there and check it out. Thank you, I, I appreciate it. Well, look at that. Just like that, we have more business. Let's unhook this guy from here. Let's raise it up. And then let's go check it out. Luckily, he's not too far. So we could just run over there really quickly and uh, go check it out, see how his vehicle is doing. Hopefully, it's not too bad, though, because we have a lot to do. We still need to get on that case harvester and get it fixed, um, but we'll get to that. Let's go quickly check out his place and uh, see how his truck is doing. All right, seems like we're pulling up here. I see the camper. I don't see a truck. Okay. He said it was, of course, it's muddy. Oh, my gosh. Uh, do we need to lock the hubs on this thing? I think we're good. It's got at least mud tires on here. Let's see if the work truck can get through the mud. Oh, this is deep. Where is his truck? Oh my gosh. That's what he wants us to work on? I think I know why his truck doesn't work. Looks like his drive shaft probably hit this rock. All right, we'll see if we have the tools to fix this. I don't know if we do. We might have to go back to our shop and grab that wrecker and come uh, tow his truck. We'll see. All right, truck, turn. Come on. Come on. That's actually a really nice camper. Oh, we're about to get stuck. I'm over here looking at his camper. All right. All right we're going to break our own drive shaft. Oh, come on. Okay. Well, let's turn this thing off. Let's grab some tools. Luckily, I don't need to lift the truck up because it's tall enough. Yeah, I'm not so sure we're going to be able to fix this. We could probably put it in four-wheel drive and drive it back, but I don't want to break anything else. Yeah, it just won't drive. I just don't think I can fix that. We're going to have to haul it back to our place. So let's go back to our place, get that wrecker, come hook up to it, and we'll see if we can tow it back to uh, our place. Maybe we'll get it fixed. I don't, I don't know if we're going to drive through the mud, but I'm going to try. Come on, work truck. All right. We'll be right back. Back here at our place. Uh, let's unhook the truck from the case tractor. See if we can grab that winch down there. Okay. I'll leave the hook on that one. Uh, we'll grab a hook and take a hook with us, though. Let's turn this guy on. That's how we can warm up. Man, I don't know if this little truck's going to be able to pull that huge truck. It's so tall. Okay. Let's grab a... Let's grab a hook. I know I got one here somewhere. There it is. Perfect. Okay, got the hook. Let's run over there. See if this truck can get it through the mud? I don't know if it's going to be able to. But we'll try. And uh, we'll try and get his truck pulled back over here. Here we are. Uh, I don't know if this thing's going to be able to go through the mud. I, I don't think it's going to be able to. We have street tires. This thing weighs a million pounds. Oh gosh, we're going to have to be pulling ourselves out of here. I can already see this coming. Looks like there might be a bottom under the mud. It seems like it's going through it pretty good, actually. Okay. All right, let's take the hook off. Let's go hook it to his truck. That way we can use this to pull him out if needed. All right, got it attached. Let's make sure it's not in park or something crazy. Okay, we're good there. All right. Here it goes. We're going to try. I don't know if this is going to work, but we're going to give it our all. Let's back the truck up. I don't want to get too close to the water and flip the truck. Okay, I'm going to park it right there. All right. It's hooked up. All right, let's turn on the winch. Okay, we got the winch on. Let's see if I can get a rock. Okay, it's not too deep there. So I'm going to use the remote. Let's see if we can... Pull the truck. Okay, come on. Pull it over the rock. Oh gosh, oh no. We're about to flip our truck. This is scary. Oh god. Okay, 
Right, let's stop that right there for now. I'm gonna see if we can even get our truck out of here right quick. Oh, this thing's an animal. Okay, I don't know about the mud though. Oh, we almost flipped the Ford. And now we're getting stuck. No, oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, we got it out. Let's raise it a little more. All the way up. Okay, let's take this back to the shop. First, let's see if we go through the mud. This is a bigger mud. Oh, come on, truck. Woo! That front wheel's trying to pop off the ground. Come on. Come on. You can do it! Come on! Go! Go! You're almost there! Oh, yes! All right, let's take the Ford back to the shop and... Okay. All right, we seem to be going now. Oh, it's getting a little sideways. Okay, hold on, hold on. We need to oh, slow down. No, no, no. Let's, uh, let's straighten the wheels up on this thing. There we go. That should be a little better. Now let's take it back to the shop. See if we can get this Ford fixed up. We'll call him back, have him come pick it back up. Take a ride in the truck, rear view mirror. There is no rear view mirror. Side mirrors, can't see nothing. It's back there though, we're doing pretty good. What do you think about this tow truck? I kinda like it. It's pretty old school, but gets the job done. The Ford is uh, about double the size of it. All right, we are back. We made the trip. There is, oh, we got to wash our stuff now. His truck's awful, our work truck's awful. Somehow, the tow truck stayed clean. I think we can just pull this guy right on in there. Oh, a little wheelie action going on there. Oh, come on, truck. Now you're going to struggle? Okay, there we go. All right, right about there. Can I raise it any more? Let's turn it on. Can I raise it? I can't raise it. I can let the string go a little bit. I really want to try and raise it up more so we can work on that drive shaft. Actually, I'll tell you what we'll do is we have a lift right in there. So he's just going to have to wait. And once we're done with this case tractor, I'll probably tow the truck over here, put it on that lift, and we'll get it fixed. So we're just going to leave it in the shop for now. He's going to have to wait a few days while we finish those case these case tractors up. Should we go grab his camper? I feel like we probably should and not just leave it there. Yeah, we'll go grab his camper. Why not? We'll take the work truck. It has, a, it has a hitch on the back already. We have mud tires, so I'm not too worried about getting stuck. And uh, we'll bring his camper back over here. All right, let's try and hook onto his camper. Get it pulled back to our shop as well. I'll even do him a favor. I'll go over the camper, make sure it's okay. It should be. I'm sure that rock is what uh, messed his truck up. So, slinging some mud over here. It's a nice little little pond. I bet they were swimming, fishing, probably barbecuing, enjoying their time. And then he tried to drive his truck over a rock, and uh, that's what happened. All right. I like this camper. Look at this thing. This looks like an off-road camper. It's pretty neat. Better go on the road, stay out of the field. I know there's a mud path here, but I don't want to be in Farmer John's field. You don't want to make Farmer John mad, trust me. So now we have this muddy as well, but hey, I think feel like we did him a favor. So we got back with our work truck, which is a mud disaster. His camper, which I really like. I might need to invest in one of these. This thing looks awesome. Looks like it could probably flip and it would be okay. We got to get that case tractor fixed before we could fix his truck. So we'll have to get to that later on. I'll give him a shout. Oh my gosh. Was this here earlier or do I need to fix this also? Oh my gosh. The work just keeps piling up. The case harvester, I don't even know what's wrong with it, but it's almost harvesting season. So we need to get after that as well. We're pretty booked up. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. If you could subscribe to the channel as well, I would also appreciate that. So until next time, make sure you thumbs up, like, subscribe, watch more of our videos. Bye.